Picture the scene, you're sitting at the dinner table and your beloved Labrador is doing their best sitting right next to your chair, looking up at you with sad brown eyes and perhaps even drooling or whining. For many dog owners, this pretty much describes every mealtime ever. And, thanks to their unending appetite and unwavering love of food, it's even more relevant when you're a pet parent to a Labrador. Many dog lovers simply accept this as part and parcel of having a canine companion. However, it can still get frustrating. Plus, if you entertain guests who aren't used to dogs, it can be embarrassing for you and annoying for them. The good news is, it's entirely possible to train your Labrador to stop begging for food. The bad news is, it can take some time to perfect, especially if you have an older dog who's been getting away with begging for food for years. It also requires a healthy dose of patience and repetition. If you're willing to put in the work, watch on and we'll tell you how to stop your Labrador begging for food. Before we move on with this video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him her. Link to the free, secret training technique, guide is in the description below. Why does your Labrador beg for food, anyway? On the most basic level, your dog begs for food because they can smell it, they know it will taste good and they want to eat it. Labradors especially are known for their voracious appetites. So, you have to expect they'll pester you for food if you never teach them not to. From an evolutionary perspective, dogs were pretty much designed to beg for food. Back before dogs had evolved from wolves, the members of the pack that were lower in the hierarchy would have to wait until the alpha members were done with their meal and take what was left. Slightly later, modern dogs evolved in the main part due to their relationship with humans. These early dogs would help humans to hunt. In return, their human companions would share food with them. So, it's natural for dogs to look to humans as a source of food. Especially when you consider that even today we provide food for our dogs. If you've ever fed your dog while they were begging, told them off, smiled at them, stroked them, or otherwise given them attention, then you're part of the problem. But, don't worry. Start now and soon you'll have a dog with perfect manners at the dinner table. Be consistent. The first rule of dog training is to always be consistent. The second rule of dog training is to always be consistent. To learn, dogs need to know their behavior is okay all the time or never okay. If you don't mind your dog begging at the table, that's fine. If you give in to those adorable, puppy dog eyes, just one time in ten, they're still going to beg for food every single time. However, for anyone who likes sharing their food with their four-legged friend, don't be disheartened. This doesn't mean you can never give your dog, people food, or even share some of your food from the table. It just means you have to be very clear about when you feed your lab. Do it right so you're rewarding good behaviors rather than reinforcing negative ones. How to stop your lab begging for food when at the table? As we've already stressed, it will take patience and consistency, but you'll get there eventually. 1. Decide where you want your dog to be while you eat. The method essentially boils down to ignoring unwanted behavior and rewarding desired behavior. So, you need to figure out what constitutes desired behavior. Decide where you want your dog to be while you eat. We'd recommend placing a doggy bed somewhere not too close to the table but close enough you can throw your pup a treat with fairly good accuracy. When they've got the hang of not begging, you can move it further away if you prefer. Tell your dog to lie on the bed at the start of your mealtime. If you've taught them a, down stay, you can give this command. 2. Ignore any unwanted behavior. This is the hard part for some people, but it gets results. You need to completely ignore any unwanted behavior. Begging behaviors vary from dog to dog and include anything from silently sitting and staring to drooling to barking or whining. When we tell you to ignore these behaviors, we mean completely ignore them, don't just not reward them. So, in addition to not rewarding your pup by giving them what they want, food, also refrain from telling them to lie back down, scolding them, saying, no, petting them, reassuring them or even looking at them. 3. Reward desired behavior. What you're doing here is waiting it out. 
If you ignore your dogs begging for long enough, they'll eventually figure out it's not working and go and do something else. Ultimately, you want your dog to go lie down on their bed, which was what you originally asked them to do. However, lying down anywhere on the floor, going to play with a toy, sitting down quietly away from the table, or doing anything positive that's not begging for food is good enough. For, repeat, repeat, repeat. Your dog won't understand this after happening just once. In fact, don't be surprised if they immediately resume begging after the first few times you reward them for not begging. Repetition is key here. At first, every single time your dog lies on their bed, lies on the floor or otherwise stops their begging, give them a treat right away. If they stay lying down after receiving the treat, throw them another. As your dog gets better at this, you can spread out the intervals between giving treats. Eventually, you might only need to give your dog one or two treats to keep them lying down the whole meal. Of course, you can still choose to throw your dog a treat every couple of minutes if you prefer. Now that you know how to stop your Labrador begging for food you'll have realized it's not that hard in theory. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the Secret Training Technique Guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the Little Paws Training channel if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.